police officers will tell you, they remember places based on cases. A street because of a crash, a neighborhood because of a break-in, this Garland gas station because of a mystery. Someone's helping him. Who's helping him? That, that's the unknown. A maddening murder mystery. It's actually pretty infuriating. Because Detective Lucas Shoup believes he knows who the killer is, but no one can find him. I did not think that a 14-year-old could stay gone this long. I really did not. It is now mid-May 2022. Shoup started searching for Abel LaCosta in late December 2021. The day after Christmas, three teenagers died inside this Texaco, shot and killed when someone opened the convenience store door and fired off at least 20 rounds, according to police. They say this surveillance video shows the shooter and the truck he was riding in, and this surveillance picture shows his driver. So the vehicle will back out of this spot. Shoup, the lead investigator, can recount their every move. The driver goes in, buys something, gets back in the truck, circles the lot. And then it pulls over here and comes to a stop towards the end of the parking lot here. And they stay there for a couple of minutes. And in those couple of minutes, Shoup says the passenger was prepping. It appears to me that steps were taken based upon the surveillance video we saw that he concealed his identity. In what way? Put on a baseball cap, he removed a shirt, and he put on a face mask. What does that tell you about the case? Well, it tells me that he had enough thought process, honestly, that he's thinking about what's about to happen and he doesn't want to be identified. The day after police released the surveillance evidence, the driver turned himself in. He's Richard Acosta. He's 33. He is Abel Acosta's father. Police say Abel is the suspected shooter. He's 14 and somehow he's eluded police and U.S. Marshals for five months. Is there any evidence to support that maybe he has left the country? Uh, I do not have any evidence that actually says he's in Mexico. I can tell you I got a tip one day. He's in Mexico at the same day. We get tips that he's in Iowa, I believe, and he's in Mississippi. All three tips come in on the same day. This 26-year veteran officer knows three faces and three families will never leave his mind. Three questions linger too. Did I make any mistakes? You know, did I miss something? What else can I actually do to find him? Shoup is infuriated, but also motivated. Someone knows where he is and someone has helped him get there. To one day pass this corner and think about this case as closed. In Garland, I'm Teresa Woodard.